Okay, I'm going to be replacing the rear shocks on a 2009 Chrysler Town & Country with Monroe coilover shocks. I got these shocks from Rock Auto for about $90, but you can get them from Amazon or any parts store. Okay, so what I found out is that you have to jack up the body and also the trailing arm. Otherwise, the trailing arm is going to fall down. So there's a bolt here and a nut behind it. And you use an 18 millimeter uh, socket and wrench. 18 millimeter. Gives a good shot on the bottom part. Alright, so this is what they look like side by side. And there's some writing on here that says install this end, install this end down. And it's right in the middle of the shock. Oh, nice. But I looked at some pictures on the install instructions and it looks like this is the top and this is the bottom. So I'm going with that. This is uh, installed almost. We got the top. I'm showing how the top uh, wrenches on the shock go because the one is, is behind here. And there it is. Uh, installed on this side. 